through all of my preliminary recordings um, regarding my uh, ongoing stuff that I do, my routine. Um, we've come to the part where uh, essentially I'm t putting all my tasks and assigning them a number and rolling to decide which tasks I'm going to highlight next. This time I have rolled Ultimate Unabridged Fantasy Books. So this is a personal project for my family. It is a recurring task and a trifle. It is not significant in any way. What I am doing is creating uh, visual movies of unabridged books using the audiobooks for my family to watch. These are not for everybody. Um, I may end up putting them in the Lyricanium at some point, but I am very leery of doing that for uh, piracy reasons and blah 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 even though i'm actually putting a lot of effort into them and it's not just a direct copying currently this is my timeline for the first chapter of the hobbit an unexpected party and yes you can see a lot of stuff from the movies there's fan art there's all kinds of things i'm not going to play through this because um copyright would likely pick it up but i'm using um blue fax's version of the um the Hobbit. Um, he does an excellent, excellent job at um, re uh, reading the story in character voices. Um, I will say my hope one day is to actually do it with an AI generated Tolkien narrator and possibly AI versions of the characters either from the movies or like the best voices that I can come up with. So point being it's a combination of footage from the movies um, not sound so much from the movies but visuals um, as well as various other fan art to get the sections that don't uh, either were not converted or um, are not converted uh, translated to the film or otherwise I also changed his version of Misty Mountains as good as it is over to Clamavidi Profundus's version of Far Over the Misty Mountains, and I made sure that it lined up exactly with the text from the book. So yeah, um, eventually this is going to have the captions in it, so you can actually read along with the book as it goes. Um, there are, let me go ahead and mute this and show you what I do with um, the parts that are not movie related um like the fan art and stuff let's see here come on give me some fan art okay that'll be fine so i'm using ken burns effect which just is the same thing that i use for my animations it's just a very simple zooming effect kind of thing for that sort of thing and uh yeah it works very well um and yeah when this is done we'll be able to watch the first chapter of uh the Hobbit, and I hope to work through all of Tolkien's works uh, when it comes at least Hobbit, Little Ring, Silmarillion, um, and then Narnia as well. I may do a Narnia one next, but the point is that, yeah, I might not likely get through all of this in my lifetime. I'm only adding like one, one of these clips every day, but the fact is I'm going to get somewhere. Um, and maybe my kids will finish it. Maybe, you know, that's something that I can teach them to edit with. There's lots of different possibilities with this. And yeah, sorry for not being on camera this time, but I just really felt camera fatigued this week. And so I decided to go ahead and do this without any extra visuals. I appreciate you guys. And we'll be back with the next uh, task uh, next week.